So this is station one of the, Stoy the Soil Lab. And station one is gonna talk about soil texture. Texture actually means what something is made of or how it feels, how it appears, how it looks. For soil texture, what we're actually gonna be looking at is we're gonna be looking at what is actually inside of the soil itself. So here I have some soil. I just got it from outside, obviously not right now because it's a little cold out, but um, I did get it from outside. And all, we, all we're gonna do is we're just gonna kinda take a look at this and try to see what the texture is of this soil. And that basically means what are, what's the consistency of it? What is it made of? So for this, what we're gonna do is we're going to take a small sample. I'm just gonna use a spoon and measure out about 20. Okay, so this is a little higher, empty some of it out. Mm. All right, so we're right about at 20 milliliters now. And now I'm gonna add water in order to have it go up to 100 milliliters. So I started with 20 and then it went up to 100. Now I'm gonna take a stopper put it in the cylinder and shake it up. Now when I shake it up, what's really, really important is that all of the stuff that's in there, and I'm gonna take this bottom thing off so you can see it, everything that's in there ends up getting completely mixed up together. So you can see how some of this is kind of hanging out in the bottom. You do not want that. You wanna make sure that you really mix it up really well. It's kind of messy, that's why I'm doing this. Until it's completely, there we go. See, now it's off the bottom. So now we're going to mix it even a little bit more to make sure that the particles really get separated. And then we're going to put it down and leave it. Now what's going to happen is the little pieces of different particles that are inside of the soil are going to start falling down to the bottom. And if they're bigger, they're going to end up falling faster. And if they're smaller, they're going to end up falling slower. So what that's going to create is it's going to create layers in this column. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go over to the column and look at it and see if you can analyze the layers. See if you can tell how big those layers are. Okay, so now the soil sample has settled and we are going to try and see if we can take a look and determine the layers that settled out from the soil sample that we were looking at to try and determine the texture of the soil, what it actually is made up of. So first of all, all the way at the bottom, you can take a look and you're gonna look for any little rocks. Rocks are gravel. Those are the heaviest and the biggest particles that could be within soil. And if I take a look at this one, it doesn't look like there's very much, much gravel in there. I don't think there's any at all. So you'd probably put a zero for that one. The next one is the lightest layer, and you're going to measure that and go from the zero up and see how high that goes and try to make a decision about how high you think that layer goes and then write it on your chart under where it says sand. Sand is the next layer, and sand is the next heaviest layer that will settle out of the soil. So the first layer, the light layer, is going to be sand. Measure that and write it on your chart. The next layer is a dark layer, right above the sand, and that layer is silt. So you can measure out that layer and put that into, into the chart. That's going to be your silt layer. On top of the silt is a little bit lighter layer that is called clay. So you can measure out that layer. That's your clay number. And then you have a whole bunch of water and floating right at the top is a very small layer, which is a layer of humus. And humus is just really light material that usually settles all the way up to the top because of how light it is. So you can kind of take a look at that and write in your numbers and then calculate the percent using the equation that's right underneath the chart that you see on your worksheet. So that is soil texture.